Welcome to my PowerPoint presentation on my wireframe prototype. I'm going to use principle of interactive design, gestalt principles, and Gutenberg diagram to describe my wireframe. White space allows users to view my website with ease because they do not experience information overload. The labels on my links inform users what the, what the link does when it is triggered, making my website easy to use. My content, for example, attractive info and brief info, is cited with an image next to them. This will make them seem associated with each other. The users will also associate my award content and the image of my award due to their mapping of being above and below each other. The links look like buttons. This associates the act of clicking on a button with my links, which teaches the users to click on the links to trigger it. My worthy contents will have similar font color, family, and size, which will make the content seem associated with each other in the sense that they are comprehensive word contents. The Gutenberg diagram states that if the content is evenly distributed, our eyes tend to move from the upper left to the bottom right of a web page. Thus, I have chosen to place a book with us floater on the bottom right to encourage users to book in our hotel. My color choice is consistent because I follow a rough ratio of 60% grey, 30% black and 10% yellow. This gives the user a sense of comfort because of the consistent aesthetics. This is my menu sidebar when it is clicked on. The different web pages on my website can be easily accessed here from any other web page of my website. The header will follow the user regardless of how, how far down the user scrolls and whatever web pages they are at. This means that the user will learn to depend on my header to navigate around my website. My main page content and footer information are grouped and organized based on the relation between one another, which will help users quickly determine where to find the information they want and give the users the sense that my content is well organized. My element and footer are aligned with an invisible line, which will help the users find out where the flow of words and information is, and thus they are able to read my content easier. Now, let's proceed with my web page prototype. 